Hey, how's it going? I hope you're well. If you're nay, do something positive. Anyhow, when my lady goes out to meet her friends, social distancing, she always brings Pinot Grigio. So I thought to myself, I thought I'd have a Pinot Grigio. Fits a hair. Mmm. Fits a hair. <coughs> what? Oh my god. Fabulous. Fabulous, fabulous. Fizzy. Fruity. Fun. Mm. Praise darling. It's your turn. Alright, uh, kid. How's it going? I'm just going down to Tesco's where Kev's going to meet me. Won't be long. He's getting me a drink, you know. I've got my mask on now. I'm ready to go and meet Kev. Oh, all right. Cheers, Kev. So, cheers again, Kev, for the Pinot Grigio. I've not tasted the Pinot Grigio before. Once this girl came up to me and she said, Do you want a Pinot Grigio? And I said, Maybe, but I didn't really though. So, let's open this bad boy up and give it a try. I'm trying to be Manchester, but sometimes I'm going Yorkshire, sometimes I'm going Liverpool. Liverpool! Yeah! Right. Let's pour this in the perfect glass. It's not a glass, it's a plastic. Not good for the environment. But, if you read the back of this tin, it says, good for the planet too. It says I'm holding a can of fizzy wine. Nice these nifty little tins. Good for the planet too. Let's go. Probably you'd be expecting me to be on holiday because that's where everybody else is going because I've been so bloody desperate to get out of here. Doesn't matter, there's nothing going on like a virus that's killing people. It's been so hard not getting me son. It's been so hard without a tan. Bars are open now as well. I was in one earlier. Er earlier? I was in one earlier and I was reading the menu. Some of the highlights for me were these types of food that I've never tasted. There was one called a jalapeno. A jalapeno. What great mystery, mystery? What great mysterious food is this? Also saw is it a potato. And then I saw a car jet. A car jet. What's going on with my voice? I keep skipping from different regions. I don't know what's going on. Anyway, so anyway, let's just forget about that. What else was on the menu? There was something called Cows Cows. A song has come to my head. I only heard it the other day at work. And it's because somebody had brushed past the van door. Everybody else thought that he did it. And what he'd said was, I didn't properly hit it. I just brushed past it. What he actually said was, I didn't need to get a ding it. <laughs> I didn't need to get a ding it. Right, let's see what this tastes like. I'll try that again. I 
This is the most ridiculous cup ever. It's not practical at all. The straw goes down there. The bloody liquid's down here. I can't get any. Cheers, mm. Akid. It's great. Well, hello. I'm feeling all refined. That's the effect of Pinot Grigio has on one. <laughs> it's put me in the mood for a game of cricket. Or perhaps croquet on the lawn. Such a delicate taste. Mmm, I really do like it. I'm probably not speaking loud enough, but that's because my neighbours think I'm a head case. I am, you know. <laughs> Do you like my hair? That's also the effect this drink has on one. Anyone for cricket? How about polo? Or perhaps we should go for a dip in the lake. Even though there are no lakes in Scotland. Oh, my not eat. I could just go a square sausage with a tiny barbecue like I just saw in the news. Anyway, right, over to you, Steph, the latest, newest reviewer. Don't look at my belly. guys, I forgot you guys were coming today. So today we are trying out pin, pin, <laughs> wine in a can today. Thank you Fraser. I actually don't like wine, but we're on lockdown and I've been trapped with children for months. Hence why I'm hiding in my shed reading a book with my dog. Mmm. Actually, that's quite nice for wine. Scott, what do you think? White wine? Pinot Grigio? Let's see how that is. Right. Right. Right, thank you. Right. Here we go. Let's just go and try this one. For a canned wine, that's all right. Yeah, it's just a white wine. Well, Pinot Grigio. Mm. Uh, you try, Paul. There you go. See ya. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to another edition of The Beer Review with my good friend Scott, who is just a way to pass me a lovely Pinot Grigio. Cheers, Scott. Mmm. Today, as I said, Pinot Grigio from Italy. Bellissimo. As you can see, I am all dressed up for the special occasion. I have a masked ball to go to later on, so I thought I would have a wee taste before I left to get myself in the mood. So, let's see what this Italian beauty tastes like. Ah, refreshing. It's tart, apple, but not an apple tart. It has a crisp, refreshing taste. And a lovely smell of Italy! Bellissimo! Oh, I could just drink the whole bottle. Absolutely, okay. Light-headed. Wow. What do you think of this empty drink? Sorry, Pino Grigio from Italy. Attention. 
Attention, this is a public announcement. I have been handed this most wanted Pinot Grigio white wine. Thank you, Paul. But unfortunately, I am not able to test it as I am currently at work. And even if I wasn't at work, I would not drink it anyway because I don't like white wine. Thank you.